Hi, my name is Miranda Tias, and today we're shooting Men's Health in Malibu, California. I love, it's gonna sound weird, I know everybody would say eyes or other things, but I really like a set of shoulders. You know, shoulders could be a metaphor for a strong man that knows what he wants and his balance. So it, he could be a little bit slimmer, but I know that I can rely on his shoulder. In Italy, a man would definitely be very direct and would do anything in his power to charm you and not apologize for it. I feel like in America, guys are very respectful and it takes them a longer time to they actually say what they want and what they feel. Then with Israeli guys, I think it's in between. Israeli guys are pretty aggressive and direct. They went to the military service, they know what they want. But I like them all. I just want to say that I like French men, Italian men, Israeli men, Australians. Ugh. Not that I've ever been with all these nations, I'm just saying that I have an open mind and I think it really depends on what that guy wants to be, who he wants to be. You know, we all want the same thing. We all want a great guy and that knows how to respect a woman, makes her feel beautiful and wanted and appreciated. It just doesn't matter how he does it, I guess if he means it and he, he takes an initiative, then you know that maybe he didn't do it the right way you wanted it to be, but he tried his best because I sometimes can communicate something that is the opposite than what I mean. Because I would be in a bar or a place or a restaurant and if I like a guy I become mute. So you normally guys think that I'm not interested but it's the exact opposite. I guess it's important for every relationship to have a willingness of, of, and desire to know about that person's roots and background and culture and be open to to embrace it and learn about it. I'm, I'm not saying that we all have to do the same things, but it's, it's really a, a beautiful place to be in with that person. Your friend or your partner is interested in sharing those experiences with you, you know, like the holidays or a Shabbat dinner. It has nothing to do with religion, but it's just getting to know that person through the way he was educated and, and, and raised. So I would love my partner to come to visit my country, like I would go to visit his country and then we could go visit a country we're not even familiar with. I really want to celebrate Christmas, I want to do the whole thing with the gifts and stuff, we don't have that in Israel and it seems like real fun, so, but we'll do, you know, Hanukkah and Rosh Hashanah and Shabbat dinners and Passover, it's fun, mix it, mix it up. I'm on the show Crash on Stars Network and I have a movie coming out the next three days on November 19th. We are having the best time doing this shoot. We have an amazing crew and it's really fun and hot. So I hope you enjoy it. Ciao.